What is up, family? Today I'm joined with my good friend Max from It's Maximo. Links in the description. But today we have something a little different for you. It's not a crazy, haunted, spooky type video. No, you guys know that there's a solar eclipse tomorrow, which is on Monday. And what were you saying, Max? Like all the stores are sold out on all the glasses? Every single store in the world is sold out. Everywhere. And they're going for up to $50 to $100. What a lot of people don't know, and some of you may have already seen this little life hack or this little trick, but we're going to show you how to make solar eclipse glasses for free from stuff that you have in your house. This is what you're going to need. Any cereal box, some tin foil, some tape, some scissors, and some paper. That's all you're going to need. So let's get right into this, and I want you guys to be able to see that solar eclipse tomorrow. All right, you ready? Let's go. All right. First, what you're gonna do is you're gonna take the cereal box, okay? What you wanna do is you wanna open it up. Thank you, sir. Much. Actually, for, for this, I'll, I'll take the smaller scissors since I gotta make small cuts. No big scissors. All right, so what you wanna do, guys, is you wanna cut basically a square here and a square here, okay? So, Max, you wanna go ahead and, and take care of that. Basically, you're gonna cut that off, that off, and this end off on both sides. So, Max is gonna cut that off, and while he's doing that, I'm going to get the tin foil out. Don't need a very big piece. Matter of fact, half of this would work just fine. That's all you're going to need is about a piece that big. So let's discard that. Now, a piece of paper. What do you need that for? Where's those other scissors? I threw them. You threw them. Great. He threw the scissors. No Wonderful. Big scissors, small scissors. Okay. So what you're going to do is you want to cut... A piece of paper basically as big as the bottom of that box is so I'm just gonna guess this is right and I can adjust it once Max finishes cutting this box maybe before the solar eclipse happens <laughs> but let's see here that might do something around that size my time you gotta take your time guys make sure you got the perfect squares unless you want to get blind like exactly per man that looks great man take your time and you won't get blind like james right yeah you don't want to be blind like me so you might even get worse and you know what gosh can you imagine if i go look at the sun i mean how much more can it get okay show them there we go perfection now we need to put this at the bottom of that box i can't even look at let me see let me see if my my calculations are way off all right where's them scissors i'll do it i'll show you that okay I'll show you the easy way to do this yeah make sure it's it can be a little bit smaller like a little bit smaller than the bottom of the box is good dude 50 people just clicked off this video just kidding. <laughs> yes, I mean, you can skip. I'll, I'll pull a time on the, the thing when this is done. Almost. Done. Maybe maybe we should have just prepared the, the size of that piece of paper first. Yeah, maybe we should. That's okay. Maybe I just edit this part out. <laughs> Perfect. Boom. Now you want to stick that inside the box and tape oh, there, it. There's one issue though. What? Look. Nope, that's not what it's for. See, he doesn't know the trick yet. Oh, All right, guys. Trick. So you need to open up the box. And where's our piece of paper? Okay, my suggestion to make this easier is put a piece of tape like on both sides now so you don't have to do it once it's in that box. Maybe a little easier to do or maybe it won't. We'll find out. All right, so you want to take that piece of paper, get it all the way in the bottom. Pretty, pretty not a good job, guys. That's not how you do it, okay? <laughs> Definitely not a good job. Okay. Bam. That's what it looks like, guys. White on the bottom of the box. Let me see. That's it. You got to get the white on the very bottom. Can't be doing anything. If it's not white on the bottom, fix it. If you don't, you're going to go blind. Tape the, tape the box shut now. Hey, guys. Tape those flaps closed. And I take the flaps on the top that you have not cut, close them, take tape. Perfect. I can get the tape. I got the tape. Boom. Now look, you guys. Now make sure to tape a little bit more. Wait, my tape is. I'm not gonna tape. Make it. sure it's not lopsided, guys. You gotta make sure. All right. You gotta tape this good because if you don't tape it good, you're gonna go blind. That's so how you take the tape, put it here, 
Go around, bam. Now I do suggest using Cocoa Pebbles box for this, Yeah. but it really doesn't matter because it's all the same, but I like Cocoa Pebbles. Most so. I use Fruity Pebbles, but Cocoa Pebbles are better. Perfect. All right, now what you're gonna do is on one side, guys, I guess depends which way you wanna look, you're gonna cover one side with tin foil, basically like this. And once you get that tin foil nice and snug, you're gonna tape all around it really good. So put a big piece there right there. No, 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 on the corners, on the edges. On the corners. You don't want to do it on the middle, guys. You want to do it on the, the middle, edges. Not the middle. Corners. See that? Boom. Boom. Take that. And then you can just go all the way around if you want. All right, guys. That, uh, hey, that pretty much does it. So now you got, uh, like, pretty much done. One last step. Okay. Now you may want to take something other than scissors, uh, maybe like a pencil or a pen, but I don't have a pencil or a pen on me right now. What you want to do guys is you want to make a hole right in this tin foil. It doesn't have to be too, well, let me, let me open this up and make it like this. Okay. Uh, you kind of want to make it like a normal round hole. It does not have to be perfect, but that's my hole. Good enough. And we're done. That's it guys. Now what you're gonna do is when you see the solar eclipse, let's pretend you guys are the solar eclipse. You're the sun right now, okay? We don't wanna look at the sun. We wanna turn our backs to the sun. What you're gonna do is on this side right here that's open, you're gonna look in here, okay? And you're gonna perfectly see the solar eclipse. What happens is it comes right through here. It reflects right off that white paper and it's almost like you're gonna be watching a movie. Best part, doesn't hurt your eyes, you're not looking at the sun, but you get to watch the eclipse, and you don't have to go buy no dang glasses. What do you think? I think it's pretty good. I mean, you just look through here, and this eclipse will happen on the end of your cereal box. Hey, you can't beat that for free. I mean, most people have this stuff right now in their house. So get out there, go make your glasses, get ready for the solar eclipse tomorrow. Do you know what time it's supposed to happen at? No, we don't either. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm sure it's all over the news. Whoa. What? I just saw the solar eclipse. Is your eyes alright? I use my ball. That's smart, bro. That is smart. That way you don't lose your vision. No, I can watch the solar eclipse. Bro, that's awesome. I gotta make one now. I, I need to watch the solar eclipse. Do you have any more cereal boxes? They're cheap. I want some fruity pebbles. Come on, let's go get some fruity pebbles. All right guys, I hope you enjoyed this video on how to build a pair of solar eclipse glasses. Go out and make yours now. And if you make some, put it on social media and tag me in it, I wanna see. And also, I actually edited and uploaded a video this morning that I was gonna make live, but I'm gonna make this one live instead. The other one I'll probably upload tomorrow. However, since you're watching this video, I'm gonna let you go watch that video right now, even though it's on private. The link will be in a pinned comment below. It's 3M challenge at a cave. Oh my gosh, TV, myself and Mosardi went into a cave. We got lost. I mean, it was crazy. So go ahead, watch that video now. And um, thanks for being here and thanks for all the support. Love you guys. Till the next episode.